All right, Derek, thanks a lot. Sorting through the maze of Medicare enrollment, Stuart Welch joins us this morning with some advice out there. Uh, the, uh, the open enrollment began yesterday. Uh, or, you know, for folks, and you got through December 31st, so the time yes. is coming. And this is <laughs> not an easy is one. Ticking. Yeah. You know what? It is really complicated. There are yeah. a lot of insurance companies involved, and in, uh, uh, even if you already have a plan in place, a lot of the insurance companies have made changes to their plan. So mm -hmm. you really need to buckle down and figure out what's going on here. Yeah, bottom line at age 65, eligible for original Medicare, but you got Part A, Part B, you've got a lot of options you can go with, right? Yep, you, you want to run through this one? It's going to be a tough hey, one. <laughs> like I said, I'll, I'll give it to you right here because the, uh, that's. That's well, one of these things that people are really struggle with when they're trying to do I, it. You know, it, it, it really is complicated, and uh, so you got 40 di 45 days to figure it out. Okay. The uh, original Medicare is uh, covers 80 percent of your medical costs, mm -hmm. and you're responsible for the other 20 percent. So 20 percent could be a lot, mm -hmm. and a lot of people want to cover that. There's a couple of ways that you can attack that. One of them is you can, uh, with the original Medicare Part A and B, you can. Uh, purchase a Medigap plan, mm -hmm. and the Medigap plan is going to cover virtually all of your medical costs mm -hmm. uh, minus a deductible of $155. So the plus is it's going to cover everything. What it does not cover is prescriptions. Mm -hmm. So if you're going to go that way, you're going to also need to get a prescription Part D plan. Mm -hmm. And when you do that, you really need to pay attention to all of the plans. Some uh, You want to look at your meds, what, what kind of medicines you're taking, and match them up with the prescription plan because some of them will cover those meds yeah. uh, uh, more thoroughly and, than and others. Sometimes you'll see the signs when you go into uh, pharmacies. You'll see the signs where I ask guys, we can help you out with that as well. So so that's one option for well, you, you to check it out and see yeah, what you would. is That's a out great there. idea. That's a great yeah. idea. Be sure and talk to your pharmacist and get them to help <laughs> you think through that. So that's great. Uh, the and, and so this this is the plan. It's going to cost you uh, between $125 and $200 a month for that, mm -hmm. plus the cost of the prescription Part D. Mm -hmm. So the other way, if you wanted to really cut your cost down, to, it can either be zero <laughs> or very low. You can go to a Medicare uh, Advantage plan, mm -hmm. and uh, and that combines the medical. Uh, care plus the prescription, mm -hmm. but you're now sharing in some of the costs uh, associated with uh, when you actually go to the doctor. So these plans are good for people that want to keep their monthly costs down and are generally pretty healthy, not going to the doctor very much. Right. And uh, so that's probably the excellent way to go for, for uh, people who are really healthy and, and just say, you know, I'll, I'll cover the out-of-pocket cost. Uh, at least share that cost with insurance companies. Bottom line, important reminder for you right now, though, is, uh, is enrollment is open right now if you are signing up for the first time or if you're wanting to make changes. This you is got, it. you got 45 days. Get December. it done. It's good to see you. Thanks so much. Thanks, Rick. Uh, how to make your home look larger.